Giant geyser eruption in Yellowstone during winter alarming's USGS. In a startling event that has sent shockwaves through the scientific community and rattled park visitors, Yellowstone National Park experienced a colossal geyser eruption amid its harsh winter landscape. The eruption, described as one of the most powerful in recent history, shot scalding water, steam, and debris hundreds of feet into the frosty air, painting a dramatic and alarming scene against the snow-covered backdrop. The geyser, located within the volatile Norris Geyser Basin, erupted with ferocity early in the morning, catching both park rangers and tourists off guard. Witnesses reported a deafening roar, followed by the ground trembling beneath their feet, as towering columns of boiling water burst through the icy crust. The eruption persisted for several minutes, creating thick clouds of steam that engulfed the surrounding area, reducing visibility to near zero and leaving an eerie, otherworldly haze. The United States Geological Survey USGS, immediately issued an alert, citing the unusual intensity and duration of the eruption. Scientists from the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory YVO, were dispatched promptly to assess the situation. Dr. Emily Carter, a leading geologist at YVO, expressed deep concern over the event's magnitude. This eruption is unlike anything we've observed in recent years. The energy released was extraordinary, and it raises critical questions about the current state of Yellowstone's geothermal system, she stated. The eruption's timing during the peak of winter has added layers of complexity to the situation. The combination of extreme cold and geothermal heat created hazardous conditions, with flash freezing steam forming slick ice sheets across park roads and trails. Park officials swiftly evacuated nearby areas, and access to the Norris Geyser Basin has been temporarily restricted to ensure public safety. Seismic activity monitors registered a series of small tremors both before and after the eruption, suggesting potential underground shifts. The USGS is closely monitoring these developments, considering the possibility of further geothermal disturbances. Dr. Kenna emphasized the need for vigilance, noting that while Yellowstone's geysers are naturally active, the scale of this event could indicate underlying changes in the magma chamber far beneath the park. Visitors who witnessed the eruption described it as both terrifying and awe-inspiring. It was like watching the Earth itself come alive, said Mark Jenkins, a tourist from Colorado. The sound, the power, the sheer force of nature, it's something I'll never forget. The USGS plans to release a comprehensive report following detailed investigations, including thermal imaging, ground deformation studies, and chemical analyses of the geyser's emissions. While experts urge caution, they also remind the public that Yellowstone's geothermal activity is part of its natural dynamic system.